Hello students, welcome to our social studies class. So right now we are going to jump start to our next topic or the continuation of our previous topic. So I would like you to listen very carefully for the slideshows next to this video. Thank you and have a nice day. Chapter 1. Religion, Morality, and Ethics Unit 1. Masters of Religion Glossary or vocabulary for the day. Number 1. Sermon A talk on religious or moral subject. Number 2. Prophet A person who is believed to be a chosen by God and teaches the words of God. Number 3. Ascetic, someone who lives a simple and strict life often for religious beliefs. For our first lesson, we have the Masters of Religion. There are a lot of religions around the world. And we are going to talk what is commonly settled here in Thailand. Open your book on page 3. Buddhism originated in India. The founder of Buddhism is the Buddha. He was a prince named Siddhartha Gautama, which means a person who has accomplished a goal. He was born in the district of Lumbini. He began to question about his sheltered and luxurious life in the palace. One day, he asked for permission to go out of the palace and saw four sites, which were a sick man, an old man, a dead man, and a monk. These things caused him to decide to leave the palace, and he spent many years on seeking a way to end suffering. He was given the title of Buddha, which means enlightened one. In Buddhism, there is also a scripture, or a holy book, named Tipitaka. It is the Buddhist scripture which gathers the sermons and teaching of Buddha. The next religion we are going to talk about is Islam. Islam originated in Mecca, Saudi Arabia. The prophet of Islam is Nabi Muhammad. He was Arabian and was born in Mecca. One day, while he was meditating in a cave of Mount Hira, God chose him as his messenger. Then Muhammad began to convey God's revelation throughout his life. Like the Tipitaka in Buddhism, the Islam also have a holy scripture or a holy book named the Holy Quran or Quran. It is the Islamic scripture which is the compilation of God's revelations bestowed upon Prophet Muhammad. And Prophet Muhammad uses this scripture to teach other people. The last religion we are going to talk about is Christianity. Christianity originated in Palestine. The prophet of Christianity is Jesus Christ. He was a Jewish and was born in Bethlehem. He was interested in religion and he went to preach the sermons to people throughout his life until he passed away by getting tortured and crucified on the Holy Cross at the age of 33. Similar to Tipitaka and the Quran, Christianity also have the Holy Book, or a Holy Scripture named Bible. It is the Christian scripture which comprises the words of God. And people nowadays, like priests and pastors, uses this one to teach other people about the Word of God. Please answer the practice activity on your book on page 5. After this slideshow, please watch the next video about five major world religions by Mr. John in TED Education. Thank you for listening and watching.